Alrighty, welcome guys, welcome back to another episode of Hanky Spanky. Okay, on this little short brief message, um, <clears throat> so some of you guys know that I had a PlayStation 2, well, at least I still do, um, and there was a game that I liked and I enjoyed, but that game had the absolute smallest little dent in it, and water in the road, uh, and then the PS2 wouldn't read the disc. So, it stopped working. Uh, and so there was this game area where I'd stop by with a friend of mine. And he was like, yeah, dude, go to here. They got a bunch of games. Like, anywhere from, like, Game Boys to PSPs and, like, first generation consoles and, like, all kinds of stuff. Game Boys and all that stuff. Uh, and so anyways, we're looking around. Because I'm asking around for the Xbox X series to go trade in for my Xbox One S. Because I'm getting the X series because it's a disc slot and I have disc games. So I need the X series to play my disc games. Anyways, stopped in the, uh, <clears throat> this one store. And uh, I found the PS2 game that got broken in the store. And, oh man, I can't wait to go home and play the game, and yeah, I just, I look forward to doing it, because, uh, well, I'm gonna, ugh. okay, so I got the game, cute, but, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll show you guys here in a second. Uh, well, here's the game, Gran Turismo 3, a spec, I'm sorry for the glare, because, uh, that's what I'm working with. But Gran Turismo 3 A Spec. Here's the back side of it. Just I'm I'm happy. I'm stoked. I, I can't wait to go home and play it. Because I haven't been able to play it for quite some time. I just missed playing it on the PlayStation or anyways. But I mean I have <clears throat> I have Gran Turismo 4. I don't really like 4. I need to play it more often to get an understanding of it, at least. If you guys can't hear me, or at least, you know, there's sound in the background. Sorry, it's hot as hell in here. I'm sweating like crazy. You'd probably see the glare off my arm and stuff. Anyways, I, yeah. Oh, man, I can't wait to go home. But, uh, yeah. And also, um, an update on the car. Uh, since I've been driving this shitty car, because I fucking hate this thing, um, but, uh, an update on the car, I will put those, uh, photos in on the next side, or, you know, you'll see them, uh, here in a little bit, but, uh, uh, when I get done with showing you guys that, I'll then explain more. Okay, so I got back home. Uh, I was looking for the controller for the PlayStation because um, I got it plugged in and everything, so forth, etc. And I have the game already put in there, but you guys won't see footage until it's well, it's dark in the trailer, and you guys can actually see it. Um, but right now, at the current time, moment, and situation that I'm running into is that. The console's running, it's on, the game is in the console, the remote is lit, and it's not reading anything. It's saying no data, reading disk, or circle for back. But it's, nothing's working. Um, I don't know what's going on with it right now, so that's where I'm trying to think of what's wrong. Because I'm just trying to play the game because I haven't played it in so damn long. Um, I even tried, I tried number four, that didn't work. And I tried number three and it's still not reading nothing. So at this rate in time, um, I, I don't know. It's It's been reading the disc for 15 minutes now. Uh, I don't know. I don't know why, where, I don't know what it's doing. I don't, so. 
back to the video. Um, to let you guys know right now, I will have to be using this, so bear with me. Okay, I thought that was a mouse. Trivet! Cat. Trivet! Trivet. What? Can't zoom in or out with this thing. That's gay. Anyways, I found the controllers. And, uh... Well, like I said before, I will be playing... Uh, playing that in the dark. But, since this is my main channel, uh... Uh, I will be playing... The, I will be uploading the actual footage from my phone to the TV, so forth, etc. on my second channel. So go subscribe to that one if you want to see content of uh, Gran Turismo as well. Um, I don't really know how to figure out how to get my footage from a PlayStation 2 before consoles were connected to internet to then actually upload to a video where it doesn't look like I'm recording off a phone or a camera or something uh, rather than just record it straight off the console like I do with my Xbox. Uh, so, speaking of Xbox as well, uh, there's a business out in Lawton that will give me a 120 trade value for the Xbox X series for my place, uh for my Xbox One S. Now, I'm trying to get the X series so that way I can still play with my disc games that I have because I'm not much for digital because if there's any game that I want to get, I would rather just get the disc, let it install from the disc and just go from there cuz digital would suck up all my internet that I have limited and uh yeah, so, but uh, if you want to see the uh, the racing footage of my races, um, go subscribe to my second channel to see that. I will, I'll try to leave a link in the description for you guys to click on uh, and go, go to there, subscribe, and watch the video from there. Um, but, I mean, I don't mind doing a race on here, on this channel as well. Um... Go subscribe to my second channel and go watch the episode in there. But, uh, yeah, uh, I guess I'll see you guys on the second channel. Okay, so I got it running. I got it, well, running, okay. I got it turned on. I got it to do its little thing, but it wasn't reading the disc because the laser is probably dirty, which it was because, well, wherever the Q-tip went, um... You probably won't be able to see it, but there is just enough on there. I mean, you pro you guys probably can't pick it up, but it's right there on the very tip of that. Um, it's dirty from the laser being, well, dirty. And in here is the original laser from the factory when this was sold. Uh, well shoot here in well Japan or here in US so uh, I just cleaned it out uh, real quick shout out to uh, DJ uh, AFK for PlayStation 2 laser cleaning uh, I did a video four months ago according to his upload so shout out to him for uh, PlayStation 2 laser cleaning uh, DJ AFK um, so uh, I appreciate that, uh, DJ, if you're watching this, thank you, I appreciate it, I can only hope that this now works after I go to plug it in, so I guess we'll find out, and, uh, well, I hope Gran Turismo plays, I really do, oh man, I've waited too long to, to not get a chance to play it again, because I don't know where I could find another functioning, um, I'm going to sit you guys down. I don't know where I could find an, another functioning uh, PlayStation 2 that's decently new and enough to where I can just plug and play and call it good from there. So, but there it is. 
PlayStation 2, love this thing. And also for all you PlayStation people and Xbox users, in case you didn't know, Xbox can't do this, but PlayStation can. At least for this one does. See the little emblem? You can rotate it to the side. So it's standing like this. I can turn it that way and it moves. So bingo. So there's that, in case you didn't know. But I don't know how many consoles can do that. I'm pretty sure it's literally just this one and the first generation of PlayStation. Um, so for anybody, this goes for anybody and everybody. If you've got a PlayStation 2 with iConnect, um, that, you know, it's the, you know, original thing, expansion bay. Uh, mine is empty, so I don't have the external hard drive for it, but I do have a memory card, which I gotta find. Um, and, uh,. Hopefully I cleaned it enough and didn't damage it from the rubbing alcohol. I did use a, for his, for the guy's video, for DJ AFK's video, he did 70% uh, uh, rubbing alcohol. I did 50% rubbing alcohol. So I guess we'll hopefully then see um, if it'll read it or not or if it will work at all. So hopefully I didn't damage it too much because... Uh, I think PlayStation 2 lasers are like 20 bucks. So, I'd have to uh, look that up. But, uh, I guess we'll find out.